Hey everyone, welcome from the Depths. I'm Manti, and this is episode 71 of the Battleship Rolls Season 4 Tournament. This episode, we've got the Phoenix by Nutter Chap going up against the Johnny Jipia by myself. Uh, we've already seen both these ships in a battle before, so let's go ahead and get this fight underway. Phoenix getting its first barrage off with uh, four of its guns. Johnny answering with 16 of its own. Quite a difference in volley strength there for their initial volleys, but uh, we'll see whether or not the Johnny can actually keep all of its guns on target for once, or if it's going to pull them out of uh, out of alignment. Wow, the Johnny's guns did not do much, that much damage, really. The hull of the Phoenix absorbing the hits quite well. down to 97% though, Johnny at 98, quite close so far. But yes, because of the, uh, the Johnny's uh, positioning and AI configuration, it is pulling its guns out of alignment, or out of their firing arc anyway. All I had to do to not have this happen was have it spawn facing right. <laughs> That's all I had to do. If I just had it facing the other direction. Because what's happening is it's trying to continue continuously turn left to keep the left moving, from my perspective, left moving enemy in its firing arc, which is turning it more and more towards it, so it's ending up sailing straight at it. If it was facing the other direction, it would be turning, you know the same way, but the, the enemy ship would already be on its left side, so it wouldn't be sailing straight at it like it is right now. And most ships spawn facing right, which is why I decided to go left, which was really dumb, it turns out. <laughs> well, Phoenix taking a couple of hits there. Johnny's guns, uh, front guns doing most of the work. Just as it did in its previous match, Phoenix at 91%, Johnny at 94.8. Phoenix is about out of materials, too. Johnny really laying down the hurt, apparently. <laughs> One barrel on that rear gun managing to get a shot off. Oh, that's because that's the only barrel that, you know, still exists, basically. One barrel in the front of the Johnny taking some damage there. Phoenix is listing a bit. She's taking some uh, a heavy beating from the four guns, listing more and more. actually getting 80% in sinking uh, time. Well, not 80% sinking, but just sinking disqualification time. The Johnny might just hold it down and keep it there. <laughs> Make it get disqualified. Oh, no, the RAM. The RAM calculations slowing everything down. Ooh, did that front gun just get disabled by that shot? I think it did. Yeah, it is no longer aiming. Ooh. That's not good for the for the Johnny, but the Phoenix is still sinking, and with no materials to repair itself, it's probably going to continue getting that sinking time, and uh, it could end up getting disqualified and eliminated from the match because of that. The Johnny still has materials to repair with it could bring that front gun back online. But it doesn't need to, it just needs to survive and let the Phoenix time out at this point. Or, you know, blow more holes in it to make sure it sinks. <laughs> oh, 
Oh wow, the whole ship got pushed downward into the water from that explosion. Did you see that? The forces of the explosions on some of these shots are uh, pretty crazy. Yes, it does. The Phoenix was not able to recover from its uh, sinking and uh, has been detonated for dis in disqualified because it never reached 80% health. So that is the end of round one here, folks. We will go ahead and get round two underway and hope that maybe the Johnny doesn't collide with the enemy because the enemy turns to the right. <laughs> if it's like against the enemy that turns to the left, it'll be fine, because the Johnny will basically just circle, but... Yeah, I, I, that was a, that was a mistake on my part. Johnny taking a couple of hits there, but it's, uh, doing just fine. Phoenix taking some hits as well. Ooh, did that take out a gun? That did hit a gun. I don't know if it's disabled or not. I think one barrel is at the very least. But the the difference in firepower here is quite noticeable. Johnny having double the guns. Or not quite double, almost double. Phoenix has uh, 10 guns to the Johnny's 16. Let's go check in on the Johnny. Taking hits to that uh, side armor, that angled side armor, just not really taking damage all that easily. Oh, well, you are getting in... the... Phoenix is getting into the stone lair. It actually got pretty deep in there in that one spot. So those guns are definitely, definitely doing damage to the Johnny's armor. Oh, did we just get some depth charge? I think we did. No, uh, it did some damage, but didn't destroy any blocks. Those depth charges can be a bit brutal depending on the armor configuration of the ship. A lot of ships don't. Oh, that! Oh, that gun just took two shells to the face. And I don't think it's. Uh, no, it is not active anymore. <laughs> oh, one of the front turrets on the Johnny got popped off completely. It's uh, a pretty big, pretty big deal since that ends up being most of its primary weaponry. Uh, see, since the, uh, the Phoenix is turning away, and it has gotten into the arc where now the Johnny... Well, no, it's still... It turned back, so now it's heading to the left again. But... If the Johnny can keep up and close the distance and, and force the, uh, the Phoenix to run away, then it might get the turn left enough to bring the rear gun into the arc. But meanwhile, the Phoenix has all of its operable guns just pounding into the Johnny. It is, Johnny is down to 90%, Phoenix is at 93%, but has burned through all of its re materials for repair. So there's that difference in uh, firepower. Ooh, Stern taking some big hits there. Did he get any other propellers? No, it doesn't look like it. Just a, a big hole in the, in the Stern there. But the, uh, the Phoenix is keeping itself in a very, very good position right now. Ooh, did that John did the Johnny's forward gun get disabled? Oh no, it's still aiming. It's just almost aiming straight forward. <laughs> yeah, see, what the Phoenix wants to do is keep moving to the left, but staying on the right side of the Johnny. Because if it crosses over... To the left, the Johnny will start turning the other direction, which will let it bring its other gun to bear. Uh-oh, this might actually be bad for it, too. It seems to have lost some speed. This might let those rear guns come into the fight. Yep, there's that. Sh there's a shot from them. Phoenix down to 89%, Johnny at 88%. Very close match right now. Oh, the 
rear guns. Oof. Yep, those rear guns on the Phoenix are down. Oh, it looks like all of them might be. This gun might still be functional, but I think it, it is disabled as well. I don't think the Phoenix has any more weapons left. The Johnny Jippia's resilience once again coming into play. This is not an easy to damage ship. Oh, well, that's, uh, that's interesting. Those explos- the, the, uh, force of those explosions, once again, doing strange and powerful things. <laughs> Johnny's turning and trying to get that 45 degree angle going again. Which might cause a, a collision here. be a little rubbing on the side. A little nudge. Doink. Not sure why it's still having all this collision lag when they aren't colliding anymore, but you know, from the depths be from the depths. And there we go. Johnny just pulling up right alongside the Phoenix here. I don't know if his guns can depress enough to actually shoot the Phoenix at this close of a range. Why do we have lag? They're not even touching anymore. Stop it. Run right. Shots getting fired, the Phoenix pulling away a bit. But I don't, the Phoenix hasn't fired in a while, so I don't think it has any operable guns and it is out of material, so it never will. As long as the Johnny doesn't do something stupid and get itself disqualified. Which you never know. It could happen. You've seen some weird things happen in this game. <laughs> the Phoenix gets rocketed forward all of a sudden by the power of the explosions. Yeah, I really should have made the, the Johnny trying to form a 45 degree angle away from the opponent rather than towards them. <laughs> but I, I want I wanted it to close in. I didn't want it to close in quite this much, but you know. Live and learn, I guess. See, now, if the Johnny could get around in front of the Phoenix, that would basically solve the issue, because in the... But it's, uh, having a little trouble doing that, because it keeps, you know, grinding its side up against the Phoenix. Thank <laughs> you. 
finally separated enough to get back to actually fighting. And this gun is uh, repeatedly shooting itself and shooting the ship in the in the deck. <laughs> Right. That's good because I was just about to, to call it and make this round a draw. I was getting sick of staring at the barely moving screen. Phoenix having uh, some buoyancy issues once again not quite sinking but quite a bit under the water down to 69% health I'm not entirely sure why that took so long to get through the, the uh, that little bit of close quarters there I mean they weren't actually touching or anything so it's kind of like what's going on but uh, there we are 80% in sinking. Oh, wait. Looks like the Phoenix managed to, to uh, rise up <laughs> from the depths instead of from the ashes. But there it goes. Now it is 80% uh, in sinking again. And that's it. The despawn is occurring. So that is the end of this match. The Johnny Jippy coming out on top, taking some uh, damage. It's ac actually uh, managed to repair, use all of its materials and repair. So that's the first. Wow, that gu that gun barrel is like sticking out to the side quite weirdly. <laughs> it's like. Kind of like, it looks kind of like a broken finger almost. I, I, like, did it get, did it, I think it, uh, it, I think it's stuck. It's not, it's not moving or aiming properly. Oh well, whatever. Anyway, thanks for watching. Make sure to check out the description for the Hall of Beauty votes, and I'll see you on the battlefield.